Hello, hello, welcome back to Peace Storm. I am Pluvius Lelon, and today we're playing the Binding of Isaac. Now, we've cleared eight runs in a row, that's one run with each character. Yeah, it's, it says nine row or it says nine runs, but the first was uh The first was basically the tutorial run, so I've got with me some dice. I'm gonna roll my D8 here to uh, see who I play as next. Okay, so I rolled a six, so one, two, three, four. Four, five, six. Ooh, Azazel. It's basically like... <laughs> it's basically like rolling a natural 20. Yeah, look at that. Oh, shit. I might have, uh, I might have Azazeled a little too hard. Okay. We're all good now. Then he has Zazeled all over those guys. It was truly one of the playthroughs ever. Alright, let's see what's in the treasure room. Uh, oh, Midas Touch. Yeah, it's not a bad item, I don't think. It basically, like, has a chance of turning enemies into gold if they touch you, right? Oh, and a soul heart. Shit. Yeah, that's right. Okay, let's try not to touch that experimental treatment. Don't want to fuck up our run in the first floor. Alright, and just like that, we now have a red heart. Take out these gapers. Yeah, Azazel is like so blatantly the best character in the base game. <laughs> it's ridiculous. Cause yeah, unless unless you're dealing with an enemy that's super fast, like, you know, the gurglings. You're basically untouchable. Okay. But I'll have to remember to go back to the sacrifice room for that eternal heart. And, you know, try to get a key. Hope I get the latch key from the boss. spend my thing on. I could go either way, honestly. You know what? Yeah, let's take Horror of Babylon. Uh, let's see if we can also take the... Nah. Okay. So no bombs and no keys. Oh, right. Going back for that Eternal Heart. Too bad I probably uh, can't get back into the Devil Room to take that uh, to take that pentagram. But oh well. In a way, we got to have our cake and eat it, too. And, you know, again, Azazel is plenty OP even without items. But we'll be able to get into the treasure room this time. Yeah, as long as we don't uh, open that gold chest without thinking. Speaking of gold, I've come back for you, my friend. <laughs> Woo. Yeah, treasure room first, then shop, then golden chest. That's, uh... Oh, we could open the golden chest right now, actually. Now that we have three keys. And we got a key out of that anyway, so it was a moot point. Uh, 
uh, yeah, let's go in the shop. Get that dang old soul heart. And, hmm, do I want the hive mind? You know what? I got plenty of coins to spare. Let's buy everything. Let's also blow up the shopkeeper. Okay. Save two cents. dollar bill whoa yeah stay away from that uh, mega troll bomb stay away from that floating butthole okay is that everything yes Gertie. It, it's alright. That was basically the only hit we took. Ah! If I'd gotten the latch key just a couple floors earlier, I could have gotten into that treasure room. But oh well, we are doing pretty great either way. Well, well, let's see what's across here. A lot. Whew. And a soul heart. triple shot. That's why it was taking so long to charge. Whoa. Man. Yeah, if you are peeing out your mouth, you want to see a doctor. If you have a fly blow up in your face, you'll want to see a doctor. Hell no! We got enough bombs, we can blow up the shopkeeper. And he had nothing. Let's uh, see what's over here, see if we can get some more coins, because I want that uh, humbling bundle. Okay, we just need one more coin. not a coin, but it is bombs. Let's see what's in here. Oh my god, all I want is a coin. Not a pretty fly, not batteries for the, the active item that I don't have. Right, let's just go in here. Yeah, the, the Pulse Worm doesn't actually do anything when, uh, when Azazel uses it. Okay. 
Yeah, pee all you want, peep. You won't stop me. Wow. So not a single coin. Uh, let's start blowing up walls then, I guess. Okay, how about over here? Nah, that's probably not it. Yeah. I give up. Maybe I'll get Pageant Boy from Chubb. Oh, there's a coin right there. <laughs> and an old bandage. And a devil room. With with no devil room items up for offer. Oh well. Let's see what the Okay, cool. Got some soul hearts to Ooh. Well, okay. We still broke even. Uh, okay, let's head to the shop now. See what's inside. Uh, yes, the humbling bundle. And a key. Down to the next floor we go. Man, 12 minutes in and we're already at the depths. This one might be another two for folks. You know, yo, if there were actual enemies in this room, that would have been dope. Yeah, gotta be very... It's one disadvantage of Azazel is that, you know, he has such short range that you gotta be super careful around these guys. Is that a shop? Yes. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I'll save up for that uh, tarot deck. I get go, 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 go. Charge up my shit. The Wheel of Fortune. Yeah, you think you're badass with your brimstone shots? Mine are a thousand times more powerful. A million kajillion times more powerful. Alright, it's over here, though. Do -do 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 -do. Nothing big. Treasure room! Hmm. Brother Bobby. Shit. I got too greedy. Uh, okay. Okay, it's head to the boss then, I guess. Oh, we got enough for the, the tarot deck. Oh, the, that's the starter deck. Well, hey. Some would say that's even better. Because then I can do this. <laughs> oh, mistakes have been made. Mistakes have definitely been made. And I unlocked the necropolis. Yeah, yeah, I'll take that. I'll take the mark. Uh, 
I do have the... Okay, yes. I have the Whore of Babylon. Like, why, why, why aren't his horns showing? Like, why isn't he clearly in Whore of Babylon state? But oh well. Oh, th thanks, game. Thanks. I unlock the Necropolis, and then it immediately sends me there. So gross. It's like, it's like, okay, for those of you, that, that enemy is called a teratoma, and for those of you who don't know what a teratoma is, it's basically like, like a living tumor. It can have hair and teeth and shit, but nobody told me that they can have spiders in them as well. <laughs> Damn it, greed. It's the second time I've been fucked by him. Oh yeah, look look at all this money I can't spend. What the fuck? Oh great. Great! So I gotta do all that again. Maybe that's maybe that's good. Maybe that's good. We we get to we get to clear the game as a character we haven't cleared the game yet as after all. here. Alright. Time for the boss. Yeah, I guess if we run out of bombs or keys, unlikely, we could uh, use our Wheel of Fortune card to gamble for more. Oh, wow. She turned into gold before she, like, touched me. So, like, you know, the gold effect happened, but I, I still didn't take damage. Ooh, do I want the boss rush? Have I? Have I? Hmm. Yeah, we'll use that Justice card right now. Okay, we don't need the Hermit. Yeah, Two of Hearts doesn't really do much. Yeah, let's see what's in the boss rush room, at least. Nah, I don't think any of this is worth uh, going through the boss rush for, so let's just, uh, let's just head on down and finish the game. Or finish the run, rather. Still have several more runs to go before we've actually finished the game. Goddamn. 
The, the triple shot always shows up when I don't need it at all. Uh, ooh. I will take that Magician card, though. Maybe I'll actually remember to use it. Yeah, I don't need that Anarchist cookbook. Too risky. Especially when I've only got one red heart. Okay. Over here and over here. And over here. God damn. Basically gonna end up exploring the whole floor even though that's not my intent. Hey, yup. That's what ended up happening. Yeah, uh, yeah. I can take Guppy's head. <laughs> Finally put that uh, hive mind I bought however many floors ago to use. Is this yeah the hanged man an item that azazel will never need ever the emperor <sighs> okay see what's in this room and then all right so i'm thinking yeah do that do a little bit of that That was a quick one. Or, I mean, that was a close one. But what's in the box? Oh, we undeniably have time to make this one a twofer, so... Alright. Fetus in a jar. Oh, shit. Save file icon changed. That's how you know shit's getting real. Alright. Time to roll again, I suppose. Uh, I rolled a four. So, one, two, three. I guess we're playing as Eve. Treasure room. It says HP up, but really, it just gives you a bunch of soul hearts. That's not HP up. Yo, what the hell? Why are there two, like, two locked doors? 
see what they both contain. I know one of them's the shop, so it's just a matter of seeing what the other one is. I was I was hoping the first door I opened wouldn't be the shop. So that, you know, I don't spend both of my keys. But Yes, I want that book of revelations inside me. Alright, so already, this is going to be a fantastic run, I can tell. So we get to fight Famine! Right, I have to... Right, I'm not playing as Azazel anymore, you can't fly. You can only fall with style. Alright, come on, yes. Shit. Hey, it's okay. My, de my dead bird's got this now. I think. Why isn't it, like, doing anything? Okay. Got our ball of bandages. <laughs> Gotta lick them all. Gross. Ah! Okay. Over here, over there. A little bit of that. Eh. Ah. If we had any bombs or keys. This room would be excellent. Oh well. Wait, if we if we can beat the next boss without uh, without getting hit, well, our chances of that just uh, decreased significantly. No, I don't need coins. I need either bombs or keys. I don't care which one. Revelations. Uh, actually, can we take on that challenge room? Oh, no. Okay. If we get the devil room on this floor, then I'll take on that challenge room after I buy something. Devil room. <sighs> All right, well, yeah, it's like <laughs> I. I won't, I won't take, I won't take the uh, Book of Belial, but you can still have my red hearts. Oh, just, just to taunt me, the game throws an open challenge room at me. Fuck you! Right on the first room of the floor. Man, this, this is taking forever. <laughs> Two down. Okay, just just three left. Two left. One left. Sure wish I could grab that peel. Yeah, gotta, 
Gotta make use of that uh, ball of bandages. Okay, at least I can get the treasure room this floor. Okay, I need either a damage up or... Or some way to, uh... Yeah. Whoa. Really hoping to get another devil room on this floor, because... Shit. So I really need to get rid of this uh, second red heart of mine. Okay, at least we can get another soul heart. Yeah, just, just whittle that fucker down. See what's in the chest. Okay. Spent a bomb to get a bomb. Fuck. Shit. Yeah, it's, it's gonna be another run like uh, that other one, isn't it? Oh well. You know, after this floor, we'll have a... You know, our, our bandage ball will be upgraded to a bandage turret. So we'll have a, a little more firepower. Come on. All we got out of that was a single bomb. Whoa. Just sending puke bombs about all willy-nilly. Alright, let's just head to the boss now. It's probably gonna kill us. Because, you know, we don't, we, don't sh we don't have shit for stats right now. Oh, right. Pestilence. Woo! Woo! If I did not have that bandage ball, I would be dead right now. Well, okay. I'd, I'd, I'd be... I'd be minus many... Yeah. I would be minus many more health than I am right now. At least we got a little more firepower now. Really hope that devil room shows up soon, though. Yeah, you know yeah. I think the I think the blood donation machine prioritizes red hearts. So, what an excellent night to have a curse. And, you know, we got free money out of it. Oh my god, that is so much better. Just try not to pick up any red hearts. <laughs> Ow, bitch! Ow, bitch! that alone for now. If I can somehow gain flight on this floor, then yeah, I'll go for that key. Okay. A quarter. Well. Hopefully we can buy something decent from the shop at least. 
Okay. A soul heart. Another key. And a PhD. Uh. Uh, oh shit. Yeah, saving that. Saving that health up for if I get into like a really hairy situation. Yeah. <laughs> Don't need the blood bag right now. Why can I not stop getting hit? I don't understand. Yeah, I'm s saving that health up, though, for when I'm down to, like, half a red heart and no soul hearts. Alright, I shouldn't say when. That's a defeatist attitude. <laughs> what I should say is if I end up with half a red heart and no soul hearts... See what that uh, card is. Okay. Yeah, I'll use the devil on Gertie. Okay. You fucker. Yes, please. Please, Mr. Devil. Unlocked Krampus in the Devil Room. That's fine. You can't hurt me anymore, Red Hearts. I go, like, two rooms without taking any damage, please. That's all I want. Yeah, he tried to get me that time, but it didn't work. I got enough coins and bombs that I can uh, help this beggar out. Ooh. I unlocked a secret room while I was at it. Ah, shit. Well, at least Greed's not going to show up in the shop this time now. Instead, it's probably going to be super Greed. But at least he won't show up in the shop on this floor. I swear to Christ. Do you see what happens, Larry? Yeah, I mean... If we can just survive this... Fuck! If we can just survive this floor, the, uh, yeah, the devil will probably show up again, and then we can give him this, this red heart that's weighing us down. Ah, 
How the fuck did I not get hit there? Do, 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 do. Alright, come on. Come at me. Yeah, I can tell you one thing. If I didn't have the Book of Revelations, I would definitely be dead. Just one room, please. Just one fucking room without getting hit. That's all I want. Alright. Soul heart. Another soul heart. As. Uh, okay, Necropolis 1. Yeah, we got enough keys that we don't need that one. Amazing, I actually went a room without getting hit. Alright, let's try and make our way to the treasure room. Okay, Loki's horns, not terrible. Not great, but not terrible. I would have preferred a damage up, but... You know, in these times, beggars cannot be choosers. I would just gotta outrun him. Yeah. In, uh, in Eve's base form is easier said than done. Alright. Our bandage turret has been upgraded. Are you fucking... Even in the Devil Room. Even in the Devil Room, I cannot avoid damage. Bro, the game's out to get me right now. After ten consecutive wins, it just said, no, fuck you, you're done. Was very close. Alright. So now we got about three quarters of our health. That's good. Motherfucker. No, maybe there's a maybe there's a blood donation machine in that arcade. There is. Okay, finally we're cursed again. Okay, go this way. Treasure room. It's okay, it's okay, we can uh we can keep using the blood donation machine. Alright, let's get that ladder. Charge our book of revelations. And donate the last of our cash. Okay, it's jammed. Couldn't donate any more even if we wanted to. Okay, 
Okay, one. Two. Three. And four. Go over here. Nothing really useful in there. And go to the boss. Yeah, if I, if, I was, if I was playing as any other character, all these HP ups would be an absolute boon. But because I'm playing as Eve, they're more like my bane. Shit, shit. Okay, yes. Give me that, give me that gimpy. Sweet suffering. Yeah, avoid that heart and avoid that heart. Fuck. A broken magnet. It kind of works. I'm gonna shit on your head. Nope. Definitely want to save that strength card. Fucking... Oh, great, and we can't go in there, because... Okay, what about... Never thought I would have to use a bomb to avoid picking up a heart. The hell? <laughs> I thought I had the PhD. Yeah, I thought, thought the PhD, like, got rid of any negative pill effects. Okay, pretty fly. Yes, give ourselves another much-needed soul heart. Here. Okay, boss time. Let's try not to pick up that red heart, though. Jet. You made a super bandage, girl. I don't care anymore. The head of Krampus. Motherfucker. Game's just doing everything except letting me get rid of my red hearts. Super Bandage Girl's basically carrying me right now. Grab 
Great. No, that's that's. I love having no soul hearts. Yeah, it's, it's exactly what I'm exactly what I want. More red hearts. boss in the next room. We're real lucky we made it this far. Amazing. What's in the box? Uh. Yeah, that could have been me. That could have been me if I'd done anything differently in that last boss fight. Yeah, so that was, uh, that was our 11th consecutive win, but right now I'm too pissed to give a shit. So, uh, if you enjoyed this video, then no further actions required on your part. Next episode, we play as Blue Baby. That's gonna be a lot of fun.